So it says for the next one, very, very quickly, because I think I'm going to get turfed out in a minute. So it says, X follows a binomial of 10, P, and I'm a variance is 2.1. Find a possible value of P. So I know my variance, my sigma squared, is NP of 1 minus P. So I know that 2.1 is 10 times P times 1 minus P. Right, so if I expand the brackets, I've got 10P minus 10P squared. So 10p squared minus 10p plus 2.1 is equal to 0. So if I solve that, it'll give me p is 0 0.3 or p is 0 0.7. Now I've got another example to have a go at, but it might be a little bit too big, but we'll give it a go. So it says, we set the alarm for 7am, believe the probability of waking is 0 0.4 is independent, so we've got one week and seven mornings. Assuming that Aaron's belief is correct, calculate the values of the mean and standard deviation. Right then, so part A. So I've got x follows a binomial of 7, 0.4. So my mean is 7 times 0 0.4, which is 2.8, and my variance is 7 times 0 0.4 times 0 0.6. Um, but I want the standard deviation, don't I? Yep, so my sigma value is the square root of that. So my sigma value is 1.3. Part B says, during a 50-week period, um, and it's got some results there, so we can find the mean and standard deviation. Right now, if you put it in your calculator, that in list one, that in list two, and then do your, um, your, your one there, you should get out that x bar is 2.8 and sigma is 2.24. So that's from your calculator. Now, if you can't do that, we'll just have another quick look at it. Then it says, well, state what's going on. Uh, state giving reasons whether it's okay. So let's have a look at the mean. So the mean is the same, so that's okay, but the standard deviation is different. And it's quite far away, oops, it's quite far away from it, isn't it? There's a massive difference between 1.3 and 2.24, if you can read what I'm writing. So therefore, it doesn't work. So it says here that, uh, does it support Aaron's beliefs? No doesn't support it. There we go, we're going to stop there, because I'm going to get kicked out.